so now let's do some questions that will give us a better insight into the working of alcohol preparation So I'll give you a set of few questions okay so I suggest that you try these questions on your own first and then uh, then match your answers with the answers which I give okay so this will help you in building up a approach to solve this kind of a questions okay so I'll suggest that you after after I write all the questions you pause the video for a while try those questions on your own and uh, then follow up with the answers okay so give the products yes ch3 ch2 ch double bond ch ch2 OH plus MnO2. MnO2 is again uh, oxidation uh, oxidation reagent. Uh, it tries to oxidize. It tries to oxidize uh, alcohols. To see one more concept, I would like to give you in between. Okay, so when we talk about oxidation and reduction products, we have alcohols we have carbonyl compounds and uh, we have carboxylic acid okay so if we try and oxidize alcohol we end up with a carbonyl compound and if we try and oxidize carbonyl compounds we end up with carboxylic acid okay now the reverse is also true if we try to hydrogenate carboxylic acid we have carbonyl compounds I mean, if we try to hydrogenate carbonyl compounds we end up with alcohol so MnO2 is an is a oxidizing agent okay it oxidizes it will try and convert alcohols to carbonyl compounds to carboxylic acids depending upon its strength not to mention okay so I I expect that you have you know some uh, fundamentals about MnO2, K2Cr2O7. If not, it's not to worry. I'll teach those in the forthcoming lectures when we have uh, reactions of alcohols. Okay, so it's a just a kind of a test. You can say that I would like to test you that uh, your knowledge about MnO2 or some oxidizing agents. Okay. Next question. Lithium aluminum hydride C.
okay um, i would suggest that you try these questions on your own first and then follow up with the answers okay now moving on to the answers the first question that we had was this ch3 ch2 ch double bond ch ch2 oh plus mno2 so mno2 being a very mild reducing agent um no, i'm sorry oxidizing agent it oxidizes this alcoholic part to its corresponding aldehyde as simple as that okay ch double bond ch ch2 sorry ch oh okay so when we use mno2 with an alcohol we get a high we get a corresponding higher oxidation product that is the aldehyde it cannot go till up to carboxylic acid because it is a very mild oxidizing agent okay moving on to the next question plus lithium aluminum hydride lithium aluminum hydride being a very strong reducing agent reduces cooh group to the corresponding alcohol and this nitro group to the corresponding amine okay so this is what we have we have ch2 ch2 oh and nh2 okay so this is what lithium aluminum hydride does okay moving on to h2 c double bond ch ch3 so the thing that we are doing here is hbo if you observe carefully okay hydroboration oxidation so the thing that we get is um anti markonikov of product okay so among this and this the anti markonikov product that we get is ph2 ch ch oh ch3 okay so i hope you understand this all right fine so the next question okay so the answer to this question was is okay so this is what really happens a carbocation is formed all right this rearranges to this because in this place the stability of the carbocation was only governed by hyper conjugations it had 1 2 3 4 5 5 alpha h okay this has less number of alpha hydrogens only two alpha hydrogens therefore less hyper conjugation forms but what extra what extra feature that is that is being added to this is resonance resonance comes into play okay so because of this resonance this carbocation is more stable than this so we have a 1 2 hydride shift making this happen there therefore we have this alcohol okay fine 